I'm Laura from Christian Aid and I'm here today in Bristol on day 11 of the Tax Justice Bus Tour of the UK and Ireland. We started off at the Greenbelt Festival where we spent four days talking to festival goers about tax dodging and how it affects the poorest people in the world. Then we went into the West Midlands, Birmingham, Wolverhampton, Lichfield Cathedral. We've also been to Cardiff, West, West Wales and Carmarthenshire, Neath, Swansea, Newport. And today we've arrived in Bristol. The bus will be leaving this afternoon and going down to Taunton as we carry on our 53 day tour of the country. We're really causing a stir everywhere we go. We're taking the message to David Cameron that we need to tackle tax dodging at its core so that the poorest overseas have the right to development. We've had a great day today. We've met two of the local MPs. We've also had about six church leaders come on board so they can take the message that tax dodging hurts the poorest back to their congregations and hopefully spread the word so we can begin this movement for change. It's been a really exciting day. Loads of people have come, taken the campaign action to David Cameron. We've had children digging in sand pits to find gold coins. We've had loads of people watching the video and talking to our partner Alvin, who comes from Tax Justice Network Africa. It's really vibrant, it's really buzzing, and hopefully when the bus comes near you, you can get on board. Every coin that is not remitted to the, to the taxman in Africa is money that uh, should have gone to education if we need to, to provide health services, if we need to build uh, schools, build infrastructure, ensure that hospitals are well equipped. So we are talking about um, the provision of essential services and the money that should fund these essential services, uh, which is not being kept there, but is being siphoned to, 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 to reach developing countries, to developed countries in the north. 